All right, hello there, fellow YouTubers, and perhaps enthusiasts of Schwartz's Deli Restaurant. Elton McFall here from Montreal, Quebec, uh, presenting you with pleasure, great pleasure. One of my great uh, recent accomplishments, a, uh, a very large uh, pen and ink drawing that I finished at the end of last year of this uh, uh, all ever known uh, and um, what's it called, what's that word I wanted to use, uh, the institution of Montreal, of all restaurants, Schwartz's Deli. Uh, this uh, restaurant uh, was opened in uh, 1928 and is still in business. And no, it's not a photo, this is not a, penny, a painting, this is a drawing that I did that I did at the end of last year in pen and markers. See, I'm 35 years old, okay? And I'm visually impaired. But, I've been drawing since I was five years old. So, that means I got almost 30 years experience in doing drawings. And you can see that me and I don't cut corners, eh? I love details. All, almost all the drawings I ever did, everything's about detail. Whether it's a little detail or, in this case, tons of detail. So maybe you're wondering about these two old cars I got here, eh? Well, you see, the thing is, at first when I had this idea in my head, as I always do, before I do a drawing, I plan it out mentally. Um, I was going to do like a, you know, 2009, 2010 car. Like, I thought about a Challenger, a Corvette, a Mustang, something hot. You know, something that when you see it, you know what it is, and it's hot. Not some jelly bean car from nowadays that I couldn't give two shits about. So, instead, I figured oh, I'll do a car from the 80s. Went through my books, found this 88 Buick uh, Century Limited photo. And, uh, yeah, and not only that, that car there, that's a 1928 Packard, which I wanted to use to symbolize the age of Schwartz's Deli. Now, mind you, I have this thing, this drawing laid out on the table here. Now, mind you, I just want to put my hand out here so you can see how large this is. This is over 20 by 25 inches long. The frame is uh, vintage. I restored it and gave it two coats of acrylic paint. Not perfect, but very nice. Very nice. So you can imagine this is a hell of a piece, eh? I mean, uh, the drawing alone, when I was showing it to people, I was saying, listen, I ain't selling this for less than 300 and it wasn't framed. I had an offer for 275 I wouldn't even sell it for that less. So imagine with the frame here, eh? You know, we're talking about like, hey, at least 500 bucks. So, if you're a Montrealer, you live near Montreal, you're in Plattsburgh, you're in Burlington, you're in Ottawa, you're in Toronto, you come to Montreal, you know what they say, money talks and bullshit walks. No checks, money order, you know, international money order, well, I can't ship it because it's glass, so. Oh yeah, let's just show you here. Check this out there. Yeah, isn't that beautiful? Look at that. I like to think I'm a professional at this point when it comes to framing. Look at that. Old style here with the nails. Beautiful. Well, hope you enjoyed it. Take it easy, folks. Bye.